I'm giving away a pack of lures from Real Time Baits. Guys, all you have to do is answer the trivia questions at the end of this video for your chance to win. Got me a cooter. That's big. Oh crap. Jay, grab the motor, grab the motor. Quick, quick, quick. So we're just here in the mangroves. Got Jaden over there fishing. And uh, we're just gonna see what we can find. Try and hook up on a few fish. He's got a shrimp lure. Oh man, there's a big old jacks up in there. It started off as a great day and then it just went downhill. I mean, I wasn't, I was, I've never really been so pissed off before when I was fishing to the point where I just wanted to quit. Check it out, you know, catch a few fish with my son and then I just get whammed by this massive, massive fish and yeah, you guys just gotta see it to believe it. What's up guys, welcome to an episode of CEO Fishing. I'm just out here with my son Jaden, going through this mangrove, I guess it's kind of like a creek or a river. Um, but yeah, I'm just kind of cruising through here and yeah, we're just seeing whatever we can catch. I got some uh, shrimp lures, I got some pilchards that I cast net. There you go, got some pilchies and uh, chumming up a little bit. Hey, right, let's see what we can get tied on, all right? Enjoy. Let's tilt this down so you can kind of see our view completely isolated out here in the middle of nowhere secret spot secret spot that just a bunch of people know about congrats to pilot 128 you are the winner of the ceo fish and tackle box guys there's another trivia question coming up at the end of this video i don't even know which one of these spots i'm supposed to be staring at so i don't even know if i'm looking at the screen so i start off the day cast net a bunch of pilchards perfect we got the perfect live bait plus we got plenty of artificial i've used the monster 3x shrimp so that started off good. Um, before I even got the cameras rolling, I hooked up a beautiful bar jack. Here's a picture right here, right here somewhere. I'm learning this crap, guys. Bear with me, but the picture's right here. Look at that bar jack, cool blue line. And then it just went downhill from there for me. What is that? So cool. Are they sea trying? Huh? Can I be sea trying? In here? Nah, they're not gonna be cool. Got a cooter, got what I want. Going back. You want? Yeah, big. Nice. Keep tight, keep tight, keep it tight. What is it? Oh, it's a jack. Jack? Egg? Fish. Yeah. There we go. Not bad. So, Jack. So for fish fight, I've been collecting footage from from you guys, from the viewers of you know bloopers and crazy fights and stuff like that. And again, I find myself in one of the bloopers. Um, I wouldn't say it's a blooper as much as it's just a really crappy situation. Um, it's two days later. I'm filming this right now just to finish up the video, and I'm still kind of pissed off about it. Uh, so yeah, check it out. Hope you enjoy more than I did, because it sucked. Bad. I got my Monster 3X shrimp right here. A little, I think it's about a eighth ounce weight. Got a bunch of snapper. I'm gonna see if I can hook onto one real quick. Ooh. Hmm. Got some? Big? <laughs> That's big. Oh crap! Jay, grab the motor, grab the motor. Quick, quick, quick. Yeah, yeah. Oh sh. Completely turn around. Turn it that way. Oh man. I guess. Yeah, no, turn it that way, that way, that way. Spooled me out. Oh my god. Oh. So I just got spooled out. I had to turn off the camera because I was cussing and stuff. Have you ever just been so pissed off that you just quit fishing? Because that's pretty much what happened. When I lost that fish, I was cussing so much. I even yelled at my son, even though it really wasn't his fault. So I felt kind of bad for that. So we kind of just cruised around and I'm still, you know, I'm still, I'm still feeling it. It's just, that's not a fish that you ever want to lose, especially not getting spooled out like that. The sun started setting and I was able to kind of just gather myself and, and, and relax, you know. Being able to spend time on the water with my son is just priceless. 
and being able to see a sunset like this and just just have no worries in the world at this particular moment in time except for that stupid fish um yeah i wouldn't trade this for the world i'm not gonna let the loss of a fish like that ruin a day with my kid all right it's trivia time guys for your chance to win these real-time baits um all you got to do is answer these trivia questions and comment your answers below and i will pick one lucky winner to be shouted out in the next video and to win the prize trivia question number one who was i fishing with today and trivia question number two what happened to me that made me want to quit fishing today comment your answers below and i will pick one lucky winner so guys if you enjoyed the show make sure you give it a thumbs up ow i just hit my ankle ow on the chair again if you guys enjoyed the show give it a thumbs up um make sure you're subscribed if you want to be a part of the show shoot me an email at brian at ceofishing.com that really hurt and as usual keep your head up keep moving forward and tight lines i'll see you guys next time With a passion, they say I be swagging and slaying in fashion. Feel like King Arthur, I just slay the dragon. My jig on the bottom, I ain't even snagging. Slay like a savage, we're snooking the best.